Hey guys, Zen up here. Today we're checking out the TH30 V2 headlamp from Thurnite. Inside the box, you get the light itself, a user's guide, a USB C charging cable, a belt clip, and a bag with some extra parts and pieces. So let's take this thing outside and see what it can do. It is a dark 30, and we are outside. We have our headlamp on its firefly mode with our cheat sheet out here in front of us. Lighting it up pretty okay. Let's go ahead and put this thing on to low. And we get some light in the yard. A little bit off of the pump house there. It's kind of a nice floody light. Let's put it on to medium low. And that lights up the yard pretty good with the naked eye on camera. Eh, a little bit. You can see it off of the pump house there, 50 feet away. Into the grass, those trees, you can barely make them out with the naked eye. About 100 feet away. Let's put it on to medium. Now we can see what's going on. Off the pump house. Trees at the end of the yard. And maybe a little bit off of the end of the fence down there that's 150 feet away let's go too high and that lights up the entire yard off of the pump house trees at the end of the grass and we can make out the end of the fence line there 150 feet away and even start to light up the trees across the street there. Let's go to our turbo. Now we're bright. Look at that. Look how floody that is. We can see the pump house. Trees at the end of the yard. We got the end of the fence there. And we're even lighting up the trees across the street there 200 feet away I don't even have to move this thing you can see everything out here let's turn on the SOS mode and let's go back to that turbo that is bright Operation of this light is pretty simple. We have one button on top here to turn it on and off and to run through all of the modes. If it is in off position and we hold down that button, we will go to Firefly, which is 0.3 lumens, and it will last there for 29 days. If we click the button again, we will go to our low mode, and that is 30 lumens, and it will last there for 55 hours. Then, if we click it again, we go to our medium low, which is 131 lumens, and it'll last there for 13 hours. Click it again, and we have to cycle through low, medium low, and medium. Now we are at 345 lumens, and it will stay lit there for 5 hours. If we click the button down again, we will go to low, medium low, medium, and now high. High is 1,256 lumens, and it will last there for 4.5 minutes, and then step down to 867 lumens, and it will last there for 111 minutes. If at any time we give it a double click, we will get to turbo, which is 3,320 lumens. It will last there for 2 minutes, and then step down to 853 lumens. For 110 minutes. We also have an SOS mode, so we can give it a triple click. And we will go to SOS, which is 665 lumens. It'll last there for 350 minutes. This light does have a memory mode for low, medium, low, medium, and high. So whatever you left it on the last time you used it, when you turn it on, it will go back to there. In this case, it was high. This has a Cree XHP70.2 LED and an orange peel reflector, which gives us that nice floody light.
Our battery is a 3100 milliamp hour, 3.6 volt, 11.16 watt hour, high discharge performance lithium ion 18650 battery. You can charge that battery separately or by using the charging port on the light itself. This is a USB-C charging port. When it's charging, the light will be red. And when it's done charging, the light will be blue. Now the wife tells me I have a big head because I think I'm right about everything. But even with that big head, I have to tighten down the straps on this thing to fit snugly. So this has plenty of room to fit over a hard hat. I usually don't like headlamps because in the summertime, moths and other critters decide they want to fly right into my face. So putting this little belt clip on here is pretty cool. It turns it from a headlamp into kind of a right angle light. And that way I can put it onto, say, my backpack or plate carrier. And I can have a light that is there shining out without having to hold on to something. This light has a maximum throw of 170 meters, has an IPX8 waterproofing, and is impact resistant for 1.5 meters. Well, that's all I have for this video. Bang around that bell icon if you want to be notified when new videos come out. Call us on the hotline if you have comments or questions and want to be featured in an upcoming video. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, check us out on the website, and we'll see you guys on the next one.